we're finally at the village. The Aurora Village. Can I save? What's in my end is let's play. Hello! Hold it right there. I will kill Where you, dude. Going? I don't hear anything. If you're referring to the giants, I took care of them. They're dead? Yep. Thoroughly expired. They were no match for us. There's an older couple back there that could use some help, though. That must have been Oneida and her husband, Gian. Thank you. Uh, we'll send help right away. So you're saying you just happened to show up at the right time, huh? I suppose. Interesting coincidence. If you're suggesting I had something to do with this attack... Whoa, whoa, take it easy. I, I have to apologize for my big friend Caleb here. We're just a little overwhelmed is all. What's been happening here? I guess you missed the endless hordes of bloodthirsty monsters on your way in? They used to stay in the mountains, away from the village. Now, they're attacking us on a daily basis. No one's been hurt yet, uh, at least not until today. If giants are showing up near Oneida's farm, things are far worse than we thought. Speaking of which, where exactly do you come from? There's nothing west of here except crazy old Korra. We're, uh... Prospectors! We are prospectors! <laughs> and we're out on an excavation to find, uh... Or deposit in the mountains, you know, gold, silver, um, manganite. Prospectors, eh? <laughs> You're certainly well armed for the job. Like you said, there are a lot of monsters out there. <sighs> well, we're indebted to you either way, so go on through. But I'm watching the two of you. I'll kill you, please. Dude. <laughs> make yourselves at home. Uh, my name is Bean. There's not much here, but we do Bean. have a merchant if you need supplies. Thank you. We'll be on our way then. I got my own merchant, thank you. His name is Bean. You're an old, old man. What are you doing being a freaking soldier? You barely can hold that stick in your hand. Spear. Thanks so much for your help. Please, make yourselves at home. Whatever. How are you two holding up? Don't worry <clears throat> about us. I'm in no rush to take on a giant, but... I think we're in the clear. Level up on experience. That's an interesting outfit you're wearing. Oh, you're one to talk. Can your friend even see from under that hat? He can oh. see everything. It's spooky, really. No reason to get defensive. Just trying to help. Jerk. Prospectors, fidgets. That was the best thing you could come up with. It was the first thing that popped into my head. It's not like you had anything better. Come on, let's get away from these guards. All right, Ara. Where to now? You're right where you need to be. The answers to your identity lie somewhere in this village. All right. I know this place, and that's for certain. I'm sure I've been here before, but nobody seems to recognize me. And you, in turn, do not recognize them. Yet I feel there is something here that may yet trigger your memory's return. Maybe we should look around for a bit then? <clears throat> if you really have been here before, maybe somebody will recognize you. That is a good idea, Fidget. Let us meet with the townspeople. I am certain that the next step of your journey will reveal itself in time. Alright. Very well. But something... something here is making me uneasy. Like the calm before a storm. New quest! Hello. Why, hello there. I'm always thrilled to see a new face, even when it's all covered up like yours. Crikey. Indeed. Well, my name is Dust, and this is Fidget. Hiya! Don't mind Mr. Grumpy. He's not big on the whole eye contact thing. Fidget and Dust, eh? Not from around here, are you? Well, neither was I originally. But this is a nice little place, if you're not in a hurry. Oh, where are my manners? I'm Augustine, local strongman. Say, you want to arm wrestle? Uh, some uh... other time, perhaps. We're just passing through. <clears throat> oh, that's a shame. Thought you looked like the arm wrestling type. You know, I heard what you did back there for Oneida. Great stuff. Maybe we can help each other out? How? Maybe. What did you have in mind? I have an old friend, a blacksmith, 
Yes. He's way up at the top of Archer's Pass. Archer. I promised I'd deliver some materials to him way back when, but haven't been up that way in ages. Area is pretty dangerous these days, if you ask me. Maybe you could deliver them for me. Tell you what, if you help me out, I'll give you this blueprint. If you give it to him along with these spare materials, he'll set you on your way right quick. A blacksmith that can craft items from blueprints? I uh -huh. think I'll take you up on that, Augustine. Well, that's great! I knew I could count on you! When you see him, just tell him that old Augustine says hello. Oh! Oh, I thought he hit me for a second! Like, I told Augustine to say hello. I was I gave him a electricity. I'm the most, most weirdest deaf ever. Say Augustine, I say hello. In another world, slash. <laughs> I'll be honest, there ain't a whole lot here, but you find a shop near the east entrance. Thanks, Augustine. Maybe we'll drop by. I thought he killed me. I really did. I thought he was going to say, to Augustine, I said hello. Then all of a sudden, Latricia just came down out of nowhere just to kill me. I thought it was going to happen, but it didn't happen. That scared me for a few seconds. It really did. Hello, you must be an artist, right? Jess? Um... Good morning? Mm. Is it though? I... well, I guess? It's raining! He guesses, wonderful. Well, perhaps you can guess that I really don't want to talk such drivel right now. Go, scurry off and leave me be. Jackass. Uh, actually, no, wait. You talk to me, buddy. Wonderful. Another moment with the Philosopher King himself. Why don't you bother Augustine or some other such buffoon? You don't need to ask me twice. We're leaving. Kick his ass. But anyway, we can't do that because we're good guys, you know? A chest? Where? Ooh, hello, bunny. Hello. I don't believe I've seen you before. We just came in from the west. Ah, oh, so you're the one everyone is talking about. Everyone's talking? Of course! You're the one who saved Oneida! Uh, my name is Mosca, and I am at your service. If you need anything, just let me know. Say, are you, uh, are you staying long? I don't know. Why do you ask? Well, if you ever find yourself heading east of the village, maybe you could let me know if the roads are safe? Oh, they're far from safe. The town guards mentioned that monsters have been attacking all sides of the village. You're better off staying inside the walls for now. Well, see, here's my problem. I I've been needing to visit someone in Denham. It's a small village on the edge of Abadi's Forest. Abadi's Forest? I imagine forest. someone is pretty important to you? Well, yeah. See, it's about a girl. Wow, Aww. surely she's worth the danger. Oh, she is. She definitely is. <laughs> I, I, I want to make sure she's okay. With all these monsters around, there's been no word from Denim at all. Mosca, if my travels take me there, I'll let her know you're thinking about her. Oh, thank you so much. You're great. You're really, really great. Just don't cry tears at me. That's kind of weird. So gossip has already got to run that I've saved people. And it's raining outside. <laughs> And now it stopped raining. Ha! All right, let's do this. There we go. You see how good I am now? I'm good now. I'm not rushing it like I was before. I was rushing it. Freaking rushing it. Oh, hello, um, Wolfie. Hey, hey, I'm talking to you. You, you're perfect. Um, Whoa. thanks. Not you. Listen. Do you hear it? Can you hear its whispers locked within? You're on drugs. Box. My box. I uh. don't hear anything. Well, of course you don't. My box has been lost. Somebody must have stolen it. Perhaps it was that Mosca fellow. He's always averting his gaze from me. Like he's hiding something. Oh, shit. Probably his distaste for your nuttiness. I can hear its whispers coming from below. Down, deep down in the earth. If you're ever down there, please, you must find my box and return it at once. And whatever you do, do not open the box. I want to open okay, the box. Right. If I find your box underground, I'll be sure to bring it back. 
I will find that freaking box. And I will open it up. And you got me so... Ooh. Hi there. Well, hello. Ah. Uh... You're a quiet one. Dust, manners. You'll have to excuse him. He's a bit worn out. Saving the village and everything, you know? Yes, I heard something about that. Already? Uh, yes. Well, good. So much Honestly, gossip. It doesn't matter. They'll just keep coming back. I... And there's nothing we can do about it. Excuse me. Wow, so emo. Why you gotta be so dark about it? I'm here to save you guys. I didn't introduce myself before. My name is Dust, and my companion here is Fidget. Hello again. Dust? Really? Is something wrong? No, I I'm sorry. It's just an interesting name. I'm Ginger. Oh, and about those people you saved. Yes? Well, that was a noble thing to do. So thank you. Aww. Aww! Oh, no! Okay. <laughs> Please don't take this the wrong way, but I'm not really in a talkative mood. Bitch. I got an experience! I got more experience! So awesome! I'm sorry guys. You know how I, you know how I am with games by now, you should know She's me. A cheerful one, huh? A bit of gratitude might have been nice. What kind of a bratty Hey, ease off, Dust. She looked like she was pretty depressed. Then screw her. I, I don't know why I said that. I'm sorry, Fidget. I I don't know what came over me just then. Come on, let's keep moving. It's probably knows. You probably, probably know her. It's probably a freaking douchebag. But who knows? <clears throat> Another chest? Really? Show me the way, Fidget. Ooh, look at that. Merchant! Savior, I had hoped you'd come. Welcome to my humble shop. I don't like food. I don't like this kind of stuff. Uh, I don't like this. How do I? Oh. Uh, uh. It costs so much. Look at that. It's amazing. Oh, I can sell stuff too? Oh, freaking beast. Sell mode. Oh, freaking beast. Freaking beast! You honor us with your patronage. Please tell your friends. Your rich ones. Oh, wow! <laughs> I swear you're trying to kill me. <laughs> Guy, why won't you love up? Why don't you screw off? <laughs> I know that I'm not leveling up. I know I'm not leveling up. So I know somebody's gonna say, you aren't leveling up. I know it. I'm doing it on purpose. But anyways, that's it for now. Got a new freaking note that I'm gonna read next after I'm done. So now that we saved, this is part one or two or three maybe. I don't know. See you dudes. Until next time.